It's a day we've been waiting for all mm -hmm. week. Our viewers have voted for their favorite local coffee shop, and we're ready to announce the winner. Mary Jo joins us from the winning shop. Rob and Charlotte, we are almost ready to announce our new three viewers dish favorite local coffee shop. But before we do, we want to say thank you to everyone for voting and take a look at the top contenders one more time. So coming in in fifth place is Beans and Cream and Sun Prairie. Fourth place went to Lucy's Loon Lake Cafe and Deli in Janesville. Third place is McFarland House Cafe in McFarland. Second place is Coffee Bean Connection in Baraboo. And their winner is, let me get a drum roll. My hands are full. Firefly Coffee House in Oregon here. So congratulations to Firefly Coffee House. So with us this morning is owner Erica Weidler, bright and early and ready to chat. So Erica, are you, were you excited? Did you expect oh, this to? This is so exciting. Yes, <laughs> definitely. Yeah, humbling and exciting. What was your response when, I know I, I talked to your manager first, but when you found out? Uh-huh. Well, it was surprising. So, yeah. Well, what is it about Firefly Coffee House that maybe you like or you love so much to be running it? Oh, well, I love this community for one. The community is amazing here. We have a lot of support from everybody. Um, we, I think we have just about the best staff around. So I love working with everybody here. And I mean, it's just a really great place. And you have to talk about the space that we're in because this is not, I would think, or your typical coffee shop. It's one huge. Can you talk about the atmosphere, what it's like? Oh, sure. Well, we've been around for about 10 years, so and we started out really small. And over the years, we've expanded. And about three years ago, we expanded to this larger space. So we we have room for everyone here. And you're known as Oregon's living room. And you can yes. really feel it while you're here because you have how many couches and tables? Oh, enough for everybody in town, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> There's enough room for everyone to come in and grab a cup of coffee before they get to work. Definitely. Great, and then you guys also do baked goods? Oh yeah, we have two bakers here and everything is baked every single morning here. Well, it seems like to be quite this space and very comfortable and livable. Erica <laughs> Weidler, thank you so much. You can check out Firefly Coffee House right here in the middle of Oregon at 114 North Main Street. They also have their website at fireflycoffeehouse.com. And Rob and Charlotte, coming up in our next segment, we are going to put Erica to the test and have her show us what it takes to make the perfect cup of coffee. Oh, good. That's okay. Good. That'll be good. I need yeah. a refill. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Mary yeah. Jo. <laughs> Well, a good cup of coffee can give you the boost you mm -hmm. need to start your day. Yep, we asked our viewers where to go and got an overwhelming response. Mary Jo is in Oregon at the coffee shop, voted as your favorite. Good morning again, Rob and Charlotte, and we are here at our winning local coffee shop, Firefly Coffee House, right here in Oregon. Erica Weiler here is the owner, and she is hard at work making people their coffee this morning. And as soon she's going to show us what it takes to make the perfect cup. So, Erica, while you're making this, what is your specialty here? Well, we have a featured Firefly Mocha, which is chocolate and orange. So is it like orange juice or peel? Or? Um, uh, an orange flavor. Oh, okay. Yes. Which one are you making now? I, I am making someone a large 2% latte. And then, so you were a barista, though, before all this. Right? I was what were, not. What were you doing before Firefly? I was sitting in a cubicle making a list of things I like and trying to make a job out of that. <laughs> and I did. And so you ended up here. Yes. With Firefly. You've been here for 10 years now. So, okay, what is this process that's going on? I have no idea. Okay, so, making. well, this is just a plain latte. So right now I'm, um, oh my goodness, this is... <laughs> Oh, Are the you pressure doing? got to me. Oh, look. <laughs> That's okay. They're, it's just going to go right in their tummy Lines anyway. Large 2% latte. <laughs> okay, but, so you're going to show us how to make your own Firefly Mocha. Yes. All right, so how do you get started? All right, so first we are going to take our portafilter and... That's this? Yes. Okay. And then grind into here. Oh, look at that go. How many times do you grind it? I'm really just looking to make it so it's 
full and then I flatten it out so it's okay. the same every single time. And how long does this process take from start to finish? Probably about 45 seconds. Oh, geez. And so, and then I tamp it down with about 40 pounds pressure. So now that's like making the juice? So what's going on now is the water pressure is going through and touching all the grinds and the coffee beans. <laughs> and so we're going to want, you know, a uh, certain amount of time here. Let me get so you out. have to get all this done in such a short amount of time with all these customers rushing in in the morning. Do you ever feel the pressure? How do you deal with all that? Oh, I you don't. Just, I mean, <laughs> we just do it. We have such a great team here. We're always helping each other out, and our customers are awesome. So it's really great just every morning to see everybody in town. Oh my gosh! Well, you're gonna have to show me how to work all this here when it comes down just a little bit. You have a lot of people waiting, but Erica, thank you so much for showing us the ropes. Thank you. you. Firefly, Firefly Coffee House right here, 114 North Main Street in downtown Oregon, Robin Scarlet. A really great atmosphere here, and Erica's obviously here. Her work is gonna show us a little bit more in depth coming up at 6:45. <laughs> all right, Mary Jo, thank you. It is the end of week two of our News 3 Viewers Dish Series. This time we wanted to know where to grab a good cup of coffee. The votes have been counted and now we have a winner. Mary Jo is in Oregon this morning with more. Charlotte and Rob, Firefly, Firefly Coffee House here in Oregon is our News 3 Viewers Dish Coffee Shop winner. So congratulations again to them. So with us this morning is Erica Weidler, the owner here. And Erica, what does it take to make a good cup of coffee here? All right, well here, I will show you. We can okay. start it up. But you have, you have to offer the disclaimer before okay, we Okay, and also, yes, just so everybody knows, <laughs> if you start working here, you're gonna have to work here for at least two months before you can even touch this machine, so. So this is like 30 days yeah. ahead. <laughs> okay, so. Crash course. So first, we grab this. That's the porta filter. Yep, you'll want to. There we go. Yep. And then you dump it. Uh, dump that. Actually, that should have been dumped already, yes. So, and, and then, then you'll rinse. rinse that off. Shoot. You can push any of that. Yep. Da -da. Oh. Stop. Yep. Okay, and then so you'll want to dry that off. Because you don't want any water in there because um, water will go the, the It'll path the of least resistance. Okay, so, yep, on. turn that on. Oh, that is fun! Yeah. And how long does this take? Oh, and that's good. You can shut oh, that off. And then you'll keep on dousing that in there. Okay. Yep, that's good. Take this, and then this. Yep. What am I doing? What is this called? Um, tamping. And then you'll want to flip it. Yeah, kind of. Is that right? <laughs> Been pretty okay. All right, and then again? that one more, and then you'll want to finish it off. Yep, that's perfect. Okay. And then, and then, you put then it under there. Yep, turn it, and then. Okay. Yes. And this goes here. Oh my gosh! You have I... been watching. I yeah. You are a quick I learner. I was trying. Yep. At and least... so now we quick get the milk. <gasps> oh! oh no. Okay, real quick, this and then. Uh, oh, yeah, and that's enough. Yep, yep. <laughs> and then we can put that under there. Okay. All right, so then when we're steaming milk, you don't want any bubbles. Yep, you just okay. want a nice velvety foam. So you can this? turn that, and once you do, yep. And then you'll want to spin it clockwise. Or actually, no, you don't move this. What you're doing is um, oh. making the steam one. So you don't even have to move your hand at all. And then the steam one's gonna make that. And actually you'll keep looking at the temperature gauge. And we want it to get in about... That looks good. Okay. All right. Yeah, sure. Okay, I'm gonna finish this up. Erica, tell us, you know, what is it about the local coffee shop before we let you go that people are so fascinated with? Well, I think days. the reason why people are like it here is that, you know, not only do we take care and expertise in the drinks that we make, but mm -hmm. I think that our staff is really great and we really like to make connections with everyone in the community and everyone in the community is just really supportive of us too. Well, thank you so much for letting us in and showing us how it's done. I obviously need a lot of work, but you did congratulations a job. again. Firefly Coffee House, our News 3 viewer <laughs> winner. You. They're right here on Main Street in Oregon. Thank you again. I'm sorry. Thank I'll you. cut up the mess. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> it looks okay, right?
Definitely. I will be here. You guys will do a better job than I did. <laughs> so that was kind of fun. Nice. I think that's great. <laughs> Back to you guys. Wow. This, we'll be covering the dry cleaning yeah, show, too. Yeah, this is another over. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I knew something was wrong when I heard a moment of silence oh. in my ear. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> There That's a, okay. There was a gasp here. Yeah. So. And remember, you're just you're just trading. It's all good. It is all good. I mean, I'll, yeah, I'm gonna so clean it up. I promise. No, I'm so fine. sorry. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Health inspectors are on the way. Yep. Oh, well. All right. <laughs>